What's up guys, welcome back to the channel, happy Halloween, and today we're going to be discussing some Ninjago Halloween costumes, so let's talk about this. Now every single Ninjago fan always of course dress as their favorite Ninjago character for Halloween, or just buy the actual costumes from a retail store. Well today we're going to be discussing some of the Ninjago costumes, official, not of course homemade because those are quite terrifying but we're mainly going to be focusing on the official halloween costumes so let's talk about this now here's of course an image of all of the halloween costumes for ninjago i think i'm pretty sure this is not every single halloween costume they have made officially but here's of course what i found that are of course official for ninjago so let's talk about each one by the release of these costumes. Starting off in 2016, when they of course released Day of the Departed, they of course made four Halloween costumes for each of the ninjas. One for Lloyd, one for Jay, one for Nia, and one for Kai. I know I didn't add Kai, I was too lazy, but there is a Kai costume on the internet. So let's talk about these three costumes. Now, I really like how they replicated the face and the mask and the torso. But my only complaint about this is they don't have the Lego minifigure legs. It's just so cursed that these Ninjago minifigures are supposed to represent Lego minifigures, but half of their torso, or shall I say legs, are literally human legs instead of, you know, Lego legs. They did it with, of course, Legacy Lloyd, which we will talk about eventually. But starting off with, of course, Day of the Departed with these, of course, suits, quite good, but the legs are a massive downgrade. Now, jumping forward to 2017 for the Lego Ninjago movie, we, of course, got three costumes, one for Lloyd, one for Kai, and one for Cole. I think that's the only time Cole got a Halloween costume, and it's from the movie, but not, like, from the show. So, yeah. Either way, they replicated, of course, the mask from the actual Lego sets, the torso, and once again, they do not have the Lego legs. Instead, it's just human legs, which I'm quite disappointed about. But either way, they're quite good. And getting into, of course, 2019 for the Legacy stuff, oh boy, we got some good ones. But let's start off with the one mask side. We, of course, got Legacy Kai, which they capture the mask, the face, the torso, and probably the legs. Looks like they're printed. But doesn't look exactly like a Lego minifigure leg, but either way, it's fine. But probably one of the best Ninjago costumes is, of course, the Legacy Lloyd Halloween costume. Now, they actually gave him actual Lego legs instead of human legs, which I absolutely love. And now, this whole Halloween costume is complete, and I really love it. But my favorite costume of all time is the human version of Legacy Kai. Now this is a human version of it. I think you can get it off of Amazon. I'm probably wrong about that. But either way, really love this cool design. The robes are of course the exact same from the Legacy Kai minifigure. And a brand new mask which you can actually fully see yourself. And really, I really like the design of this of a human instead of a Lego minifigure. Sure, it's based off of a Lego minifigure, but he captured it as a human being. So, yeah. But those are, of course, my thoughts on all of these official Ninjago Halloween costumes. I know there is a bunch more, but these are, of course, what I can find of right now because I'm too lazy to do this. But either way, comment down below on your thoughts on these Ninjago Halloween costumes. Comment down below if you would wear one of these Ninjago Halloween costumes. And that's pretty much it for today's video. And until then, thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you guys subscribe, turn on notifications whenever I post a brand new video. And until then, I'll see you guys next time. Bye!